Hello, viewers. I'm Karen Pereira from Times of India. And with me today is the charming Archie Reno, the star of the upcoming rom-com Upgraded. Thank you Hello, very much. Archie. Hi, how are you? I'm good. How are you? Yeah, very well, thank you. So, Archie, you are setting some really high boyfriend standards with your on-screen roles. Are you a fan of the rom-com genre? And uh, did you have any favourites growing up? Um, yeah, I am a little bit of a fan. I, 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 I was just saying to, uh, to somebody else that uh, I couldn't remember the name of it, but my, there, there are some really, really touching rom-coms. And one of them that sticks out for me is a film called About Time. Um, yeah, that made me cry. That, that really touched me. I, yeah, I, I love that one. Um, and then there's like classics like Notting Hill and uh, Love Actually and yeah, all, the, all those kind of ones. Um, but yeah, I think legit, it's just because they're, they're a nice, easy watch um, and they feel good films. So you can have a little bit of an escape from reality and it's quite harsh at the moment uh, for most of the world. Uh, so yeah, you know, rom-coms at the moment, people are watching to kind of help alleviate a bit of that harshness. So true. Uh, so uh, we saw you as Mal in Shadow and Bone and Camilla as Veronica in Riverdale and fans are going wild over this crossover of sorts. Uh, how did you guys, uh, you know, strike up this fiery yet cute chemistry between you? Um, it, it just came down to, uh, well, I think it just comes down to having a lot of fun and a lot of banter and and, and jokes and have just having a laugh and that kind of helps break down the barriers and get to kind of know them a lot quicker uh, through that kind of route. Um, and Camilla's very fun, very funny. And uh, yeah, that just made it really easy to kind of have that bouncy chemistry with each other um, on screen. Was like, you know, a lighthearted uh, rom-com. Uh, how much of of uh, improvisation were you all allowed? You'll have such cute scenes together. Like, it almost seems natural. I can't remember. There was a, maybe there was a bit on, on, on the aeroplane, you know, we were kind of overlapping. And that aeroplane scene where we first meet, excuse me, um, it, it kind of needed that kind of giddiness and that, like, excitement where I guess, you know, a lot of us might have met someone and been like, oh, I just really like this person. And then you kind of, I don't know, you just get too excited. Maybe it's like nerves or, uh, you know, you're, you're trying to, to impress them and you, and you, you don't want to, I'm, I'm doing it now, I'm doing it now. You, but you don't really know what to say. You just kind of, um, you, yeah, you are you're improvising. You're thinking on your feet, so it has to be snappy and quick and when we got to do yeah a little bit of improvisation there uh, from memory i've got a bad memory so it's, it's hard for me to remember <laughs> okay uh, you know uh since you're coming out of a big television franchise uh you mostly see young actors uh getting sucked into the superhero genre we, we've seen you in morbius and uh, uh now we will be seeing you in the jetty and alien uh, is there any particular genre that you want to pursue? Uh, you know, like you are going all out at it. If you could uh, share something on that. Yeah, I, there, there's nothing in particular that I'm going all out for. Uh, if a script really kind of gets me and, I'm, and it really interests me, then I'll then I'll go for that. But I do. I I am very much uh, a sci-fi fan, um, and I do. I've, I've yeah seem to be kind of drawn to those. I've done a film called Voyagers. Um, I guess Shadow and Bone kind of counts in a sense. It's more fantasy, but... Uh, and, yeah, now Alien. Um, and I'm a big Star Wars fan as well. So I think that might have something to do with it. So, yeah. Okay, Archie, it was nice speaking to you. And uh, can't wait to see more of your work. Thank you very much. Appreciate it. Nice to speak to you. Bye-bye. Bye. -bye. Bye.